Setting up a company credit card. Some features discussed in this video are not available in all the editions of MaxTrax. Please visit scottsystems.com for comparisons between the different versions. MaxTrax makes it easy to set up your company credit card to pay vendor bills and manage that account like any other vendor. This video will show you how to set up the credit card and make sure it is accounted for correctly. A company credit card is considered as another vendor. Even though we are using the card to pay bills, we have to pay the credit card charges eventually. We'll start by going to the Vendor drop-down and clicking on the Vendor List button. If the credit card vendor is not on the vendor list, click the Add Vendor button. This opens up the new vendor window. To add a vendor to our list, you need only two things, the company and the vendor code. The vendor code is something you assign to the vendor and should be something easy to remember and associate with that vendor. For record keeping purposes, you should have as much information as possible in these fields including contact, address, and phone number. We'll skip that for this video. A credit card used for paying bills requires some special handling. Click on the Accounts tab at the left of the window. Near the bottom of the window, find the AP Account section and click the Use Special Account radio button. Normally, money you have to pay your vendors is held in account 20,000 trade payables. We'll be using account 20300, which is the credit card payables account. Just start typing 20300 in the progressive search box or scroll to the 20300 account and highlight it. Click the Edit button. When the GL account window opens, use the drop down to change the type to credit card liability. This is the very important change that allows us to use this vendor to pay other vendors. Verify that everything looks correct and click the Save button. If you're using multiple credit cards to pay your bills, consider creating another GL account for each card. Just click the Add GL Account button and duplicate the 20300 account with numbers like 20310 or similar. You can also call our support team to help set up the accounts. The credit card will now be on the vendor list. To use this credit card to pay for parts or other vendor bills and max tracks, go back to the Vendors drop-down and select the Pay Bills button. Select and highlight the bill you want to pay with the company credit card and click the Next button. Tag the individual charges you want to pay and click Next again. At the Payment Method drop-down, you will now see the credit card as a method of payment. Select the card you wish to use, then click the Finish button. The charge that you paid to the vendor with the credit card is now gone and the credit card now shows as a liability to be paid later. If you record all the bills paid by the company credit card in MaxTracks, it is easy to reconcile when you receive your statement. All you have to do is compare the statement with the vendor record. You can then pay the credit card bill with the method of your choice and clear it off your records. We hope you found the preceding video helpful. MaxTrax team members are readily available to provide personal assistance via several methods as shown here, Monday through Friday, 5 a.m. to 5 p.m. Pacific Time. Thank you for watching.